man. Lively bunch here. Nice to see you all. Thanks for coming out. Each and every one of you. So anyone here go to the bathroom? Yeah. Shit? Yeah. Pee? Yeah. Not just me. You guys go too? Only in the pool. Yeah. <laughs> I go to the bathroom. I go to the bathroom a lot. I was thinking, I'd like to live in a time when people went to the bathroom outside. I was okay when people shit outside. In outhouses, I think the outhouse was a good idea. I think it was a mistake to bring the shitting from the outside to the inside of the house. <laughs> Big mistake. Shitting where you eat, shitting where you have sex, it's not a good idea. It's a terrible idea. Have you ever been at home, you had somebody come over to your house, or maybe it was a family member, you have a bathroom, it's kind of near your kitchen, you're cooking something nice, they go in the bathroom, they take a big shit, then they walk out, encased in a cloud of shitty smelling fog, like some kind of shitty smelling zombie and they ruin your food. And you have to smell it and it's mixed with your eggs. There's nothing worse than the smell of shit and eggs mixed together. Because eggs kind of smell like shit anyways. And then the shit combined with the kind of smelly shit like eggs makes like a super shit smell. It's terrible. And then I'm convinced that bringing the shitting into the house has ruined sex. I think shitting in the house is responsible for 90% of divorces. Yeah. Nobody likes to think about their partner shitting. How many people in here, you're, you're at work, you start off your day, you're like, I'm going to go home tonight. I'm going to make some sweet love to my, my partner, and you've got a whole scenario planned out in your head. You know, it gets close to bedtime, and you're looking around for your partner, and you walk by the bathroom door, and then you hear... <laughs> All of that wonderful, sexy mojo just kind of drains out of you. Then the door opens, out comes your partner, in a cloud of shitty smelling air. That's the end. That's the end of the sex. <laughs> There's no sex. Then you try to suggest maybe a shower. Now, I've, I've been married. I've been married 13 years. 13 years, together 18. It still doesn't get easy to suggest a shower before sex to your partner. Never goes over well. Even after they've immediately taken a shit. You still don't like it. Well, try to get that thought out of your head before you get down to the loving. <laughs> I'm what you call a shy shitter. <laughs> Yeah, I'm pee shy, and I'm shit shy, a shy shitter. I have two kids, a wife, and three cats. It's difficult to take a shit in my house. Now, I like sneak around, I'll get up early in the morning, right? And okay, now's my chance. Sneak downstairs, got a two-level house to the bathroom down there, right? Sit down. 5.30 in the morning, and all of a sudden, Daddy! I have to go pee! And you sit there, and your sphincter just kind of <coughs> closes right up. It's no shit left. Shitting's not going to happen. 
That's for kids. You go in that bathroom, they're after you. Then there's the cats. If you don't close the door all the way, right? You don't get the click, right? Sit down, getting ready to go. That door comes flying open. The cat runs in and he jumps up in between your legs and sits on your underpants and looks up at you. Yeah, they do that. All of my cats. So they like to sit there in my ball sweat, in my <laughs> underpants, and look up at me while I shit. Cats are vile, filthy animals. They're horrible. <laughs> Terrible. Yeah. So I don't understand why they brought the shitting inside and put it in a room right next to the bedroom or the kitchen. Right? We figured out to have an attached garage. Why not have an attached shitting room? Right? Separated by doors and soundproofing and drywall and insulation. Just a room off the side of the house. That's, that's the shitting room. It's away from everything else. I'd be all for that. Like a shitting garage or call it the shit garage or the shit bunker. I'd like a shit bunker in my house. I would build that. Yeah. I would build a shit bunker. Right on. Yeah.